girl Nicole Jackson and I'm so excited to be bringing you another video today. This is unlike a lot of videos that you're seeing on YouTube because everybody right now is pulling out spring trends and yes this is a spring trends video but not necessarily what you see. Why? Because your girl doesn't wear a lot of florals, a lot of bright neon pinks and blues and greens and stuff like that. No, I have a very minimalistic style. I wear a lot of black and whites, so I'm going to show you some comfortable black and whites to wear during spring and summer so that you can stay true to your style, okay, but still look cute and comfortable and not be overheated, okay, because it can get hot, <laughs> hot, hot. But right, before we go ahead and start this video, because it's going to be so good, okay, make sure you go ahead and subscribe right at the bottom. I that I reach 50 subscribers before the end of this month. Thank you guys and i would love to shoot another goal of 100 towards the next month i need your help to do that and especially if you're liking my content why not subscribe to my channel i mean a duh. <laughs> but also i need you to like and comment down in this video i would love to know how you feel about this video are you like me do you wear a lot of black and whites i mean you don't gotta wear florals in spring i mean what did miranda say <laughs> groundbreaking okay like everybody does that show me what everybody isn't doing and I'm gonna show you that realistically show you that that everybody is wearing black and white in summertime I mean that's people's style so if you're like me please comment down below I would love to hear your feedback and if you like the outfits that I chose in this video also make sure you subscribe on Instagram at Nicole Jack hit me up let me know that you saw this video I'm so excited to bring you this heat some of my favorite looks to wear in the spring and summer a lot of it is black focused okay with sprinkles of white because those sprinkles of white are gonna save you when it's hot as hell outside okay but I'm so excited to bring you these outfits I'm going to go ahead and start and I hope you're ready <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm already dressed from the first outfit. I thought I would open with one of my favorite outfits, okay? Honestly, you'll be surprised. I purchased this shirt, this well, this top last year at Zara and I never wore it. It was something about the way it fit me that I felt super fat in it, honestly. But I wore it this past weekend to a bridal shower for the first time and I was like, yes, like I love this top. It's super summer. I like that you have the options to wear it um, with the sleeves down, but I kind of like it with the sleeves up. It looks more sophisticated. It looks more Marie, um, Marie Antoinette. It's so, it's so super cute and sleek. It's uh, the sleeves are very thin and it's very breathable through the summertime. Excuse me if you hear my sign because coronavirus, you already know the deal. But, um, but yes, this top I want to say was maybe like $25, $30, you know, in the lower uh, Zara price tag, but still super cute. This is something that I can wear honestly in the summer and in the wintertime, but in the summertime, just the way that it's designed, it's super cute. I would just wear it in summer. I have it paired with these Zara trousers and I hope you're liking this look. Sis is going to be wearing this top a lot in the summer. So if you like this look, comment down below, let me know. And let's get to the next. you don't want to see but accentuate the curves that you do have i am going braless of course because that's just the way i like to wear my tops but i will suggest that you kind of wear some covers underneath just in case you have like a little slip i have it left out in the back but kind of tucked in in the front i kind of like this style instead of wearing it all tucked in it looks a little kind of like effortless and like put together i don't want to say put together but it looks a little bit more like effortless like you just threw it on and call it the day 
and if I was pairing this outfit with anything I know I didn't do it with the first outfit but I would do the same shoes with the first outfit and with this one so I would pair just like a cute pop of color with these I have these neon purple grung target heels that I got maybe when I had graduated um college like five years ago but I've always kept on to them because they've just been so priceless with me and this neon really came back into style last year so it's just you know like one of those things where you know you keep on and it's going to come back into a, a style and trend later on so I would just pair these with this outfit as a nice pop of color for the summertime but yes it's just very like a sleek look I love this flip I got this um last year in the winter time surprisingly so when they were coming out with spring clothing but i got this in the winter time last year at zara and it's just like a really cute slip top that you can wear honestly with anything you can pair this with a slip skirt if i wanted to do an all back uh, all back sexy look but yes you guys this is the second look a nice sexy sleek black top with some fitted zara jeans these are a little bit too big for me, I will say, as far as like how it would like it fitted, but that's because I lost weight. So I would probably go back to Zara and get a updated pair of jeans. I was gonna do that, but coronavirus, so y'all gonna get this content anyway. So yes, this is exactly how I would pair this outfit. And I hope you guys like it. A cute Zara slip top, perfect for summertime definitely breathable and glistening i would wear highlighter all over your body and if this is too much you can definitely pair a white top underneath of it short sleeve but yeah if i'm going on date nights i like to be a little bit on the sexier side so this is something i would totally wear all right y'all this is my third outfit definitely casual but cute i would definitely wear a jacket with this um, it would be my black members only jacket that I featured in my spring jacket video. Make sure you click that video down at the bottom because I have plugged that in. Um, and this top is an Adidas Bandu top. I saw this on a blogger and I was like, a sis? <laughs> we are purchasing, <laughs> okay? And it is the cutest Bandu top. I have a big bosom, so I really don't have to worry about fitting my boobs into a top. And this fits perfectly I don't have to wear a bra and I love that because I don't really like wearing bras all the time especially during the summertime it can just be very hot so this is a cute alternative and then I paired it with my sweatpants from Pretty Little Thing one thing I will say about this outfit is because it's all black and I know that you may be worried about the sun the one tip that I would suggest is wearing an all black outfit that's breathable so in this outfit, my arms are out, my chest is out, I have a little midriff out. I'm definitely getting some air in areas that maybe have that may have been constricted wearing an all black outfit. So I'm getting air in those areas that need to, so I'm not overheating my body. So that's just one tip I would say if you're wearing all black, make sure you leave a little bit of skin out so you can breathe and you're not dying when the sun rays are hitting you and you're wearing all black making yourself even hotter. So with this, if the sun were to hit me, I would be perfectly fine. Of course, make sure I wear some suntan lotion so I don't get a mean tan in these areas. But I am so comfy. I love this bandu top. Um, Adidas has came out with some fire pieces like this bandu top. I know they came out with a scarf, a logo scarf in the winter time, which has been like all sold out. Can't even find that anywhere. But Adidas is coming out with some like some amazing logo apparel. And um, I love that, especially like my street style. I, I love, 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 love things like that. I know I'm not gonna see anybody with that. So that's more of my style. With this, of course, because I'm wearing Adidas, I'm gonna wear Adidas shoes. My Yeezy 500s, um, just because I wear my Yeezy 350s a lot, they're all black. So the 500s, they actually look very cute with that. And it's not the same color black. It's kind of like an ashy black. So it adds a little bit more color and depth to my outfit rather than wearing the 350s. I mean, I could wear that if I felt like it, but um, I want to give my 500s some rotation. So let me know if you like this outfit, of course, the way Yeezys you would wear with this outfit. And of course, comment down below if you're loving this 
on that look. Um, and it's always comfortable. I'm not hot, okay? I am very much comfortable. 
comfortable in the summertime and I can make sure you're comfortable too. So I hope you love this video. Make sure you subscribe right at the bottom. Make sure you like this video if you love the content and also comment and let me know your favorite look and what black outfits you like to wear in the spring and summer.